Yeah, we need to get a lead emote. We need to get Kevin on that. Oh, jeez, look at this. <laughs> that was a late up. start. <laughs> Bad up and down movement. Uh, yeah, we started over because I, because I died. I got Lionel, but I got a gold, so it's it's satisfied. If I didn't have a gold, I would have continued until I got a gold. If I if I have to restart before beating level two, then it doesn't count. That's like the mental thing I have in my head. It's kind of what I got to with my runs. It was pretty much just like yeah, if I have to restart before Master Sword, I don't care anymore. So you just straight up don't even track for the bomb drop anymore, huh? Yeah, I, I, I don't care enough. Getting a bomb before does help quite a bit, though. It saves a key, which allows me... Oh, why did I do that? Oh, God, why did I do that, too? Give me a heart. Give me a heart. Piss. Yeah, there you go, Joshua. We're on the same page. Same page in different books, though. Yep. <laughs> I could just bomb the north wall here. If I have a bomb. And it prevents me from having to use it. Or... I don't have to use this key. Which in like level 4, I don't have to beat all the Gibdos in one of those rooms. I thought about learning this game once upon a time. I would say... I don't really even know the game too well. Well... I don't really want to learn a game that's so... Heavily based around manipulating when enemies drop items. Not a fan yeah. of that concept. Doesn't seem fun to me. Yeah, I don't like that either, which is why I, I don't so do it. Most of why I haven't bothered. It's kind of why Link's Awakening is a turn off for me. It's like half the run you're trying to just manipulate when you're gonna get a piece of power. Not piss. Yeah, I just don't do it. So, like, the stuff that's random, I just don't do it. Yeah. I I do that with the full understanding that I will never be able to compete in this game at a higher level. But it's just about the incremental increases. I mean, as long as you're having fun, there's no problem with it that I see. I mean, That's why I like Twitch's runs. You shouldn't be playing to like... What was that sponsor? If you're trying to speed run for bragging rights, you're doing it wrong in my opinion. Yeah, this is this is why I like doing the glitchless runs, because I can still enjoy the game that I love. Yeah. Just try and get a good time in it. I don't think I will ever do a game that's not glitchless. Hmm. I well, enjoy I'll, like... I'll learn a few glitches, because some of them are fun to pull off. If it's like some cool tech, but I like the stuff allowed in Link to the Past because there's nothing like majorly game breaking. It keeps it interesting. It's, it's just, just cool to swim to when you don't have flippers. Yeah. Fake flippers is cool. Spin speed is cool. Bomb jumping's cool. Though I would never consider bomb jumping a glitch personally, except for Majora's Mask where they broke it. <laughs> oh, you piece of lever! I mean, accidental glitches happen. Like, for a leaderboard submission, accidental glitches aren't allowed. This is why a lot of the time in my Master Quest runs, I, like, intentionally go in a stupid way into the Ice Cavern, because you can accidentally glitch into Jabu, because the game makes sense. Wow, you got a bop right there. I got, I got massacred. 
cheese. A little cheese just lying around then, if that's the case. It looks more like Dorito chips to me. Now we get bumps. Oh yeah, I guess it wouldn't auto-equip bow because you don't technically have arrows yet, huh? Like Dorito chips are whatever color they want to be. You don't get to tell Dorito chips what color they have to be. Why did I kill those? I still have the, like, I gotta kill the enemies mentality. You are cutting out a lot. Let me turn off the stream and see if I can hear you now. You said my voice is cutting out? On Discord, for me. I'm sure it's probably fine on stream. Best flavor of Doritos to eat after a workout? Uh, I don't think I would want to <laughs> eat something like chips after working out, personally. Especially Doritos, like, don't those dry out your mouth? That'd be crazy. I probably had a really good level two during my last time through. Yeah, that'll happen. No golds yet. Oh, piss. I wouldn't really consider either of those glitches, Joshua. Cool Ranch is probably my go-to flavor of Dorito. But I don't really eat chips very often. Not much of a junk food kind of guy. I'll get pretzels every now and then, but that's about it. Some purple one, I don't remember what it was called. Spicy something. Pepper or something, I don't remember. But the purple, really like. the purple Doritos. Yeah. I don't remember what it's what the flavor is actually called. Spicy nacho or something like that. I don't remember. I think I just like the original Doritos the best. The red ones? The nacho cheese, I think is what they're called, right? Sweet chili, I think that's right, yeah. Yeah, we've got some chili flavor. Our flavors are different, but I, I, I really enjoy the, the chili flavor. Yeah, there's a weird one that was in Canada that Eric kept trying to get me to put them on. America actually has very bland Dorito flavors compared to other countries I've been to. Surprising. It is actually, because it's like we have 30 different flavors of Oreos. <laughs> Stop going over there. Oh man, is it gonna get Lionel again? I love Crumpet Save Lincoln. Dude, that Lionel. Oh my goodness. All that time. That was quite a dance. Oh, 
he's doing up A's now. We're getting next level. Yeah, that that uh that band-aid was ripped off. <laughs> Did you do it in your current TV? Yeah, oh yeah. Nice. That's that's part I'm of I'm so the... proud of you. I've come a long way. <laughs> come a long way from believing saving and quitting was a glitch. Ooh, all right. I need seven rupees. I don't want to go to that other screen. What do you need to get? Man? I still get the uh, the the blue ring. Take a rupee location to the right, to the left for 10 rupees, but I don't want to go over there. It's too far. Oh, what the hell. This is not going very well right now. <laughs> Rings 250, isn't it? Something like that? I don't even remember. What the heck? No rupees were dropped that day. Alright, we're going without the... Oh man, the run's evolving right before our eyes. Playing no no ring. Getting gutsy. Yeah, there's a 24/7 store like I don't know, 10 minute walk from where I live, but I don't think I've ever go there for anything. Yeah, we're not really a fan of 24/7. works nights. Get better at capitalism? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, not, I'm not brave enough for politics. Or any of those long that's, words. It's more economy, but alright. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, just like abstinent from it. <laughs> grumble Grumble is the most fair puzzle. It's fine, honestly, because this game was intended to be like very much go explore, go do. Like, go figure things out on your own. Which is why I think a lot of people seem to like Rest of the Wild, because it we adopted that formula, but, but it put it in pretty 3D that people will actually play. It really broke the conventions of the Zelda series. No, it went back to the conventions of the Zelda series. Back when horses didn't run into trees. Because <laughs> they didn't exist. I mean, you went from this... Adventure of Link was still somewhat open. Like, you had to get some items to get to some places. Link to the Past, you could argue, was open, but at the same time, it was just like, this is Crystal 1 and 2 and 3 and whatever. I'm losing time all over the place here. And, like, oh pretty much ever since then, it's been it's quite handholdy. Oh, this is your 40 second split because you were behind as soon as you split. <laughs> If you gold, but you're still behind, is it gold? Is it... Yes, it's still gold. Okay. I gotta get a gold here, because I'm not feeling confident about PB. So remember I had that run that was pretty much just reds and golds? There were no pinks that we could get? Oh, we'll... There'll be some pink here. This might be a pink.
Oh, there's a gold. Like three seconds. We did it, boys. Well, I don't know how much is a gold buy. But... <laughs> what dungeon are we in here? Second. A link to the past is where they like, yeah, it's where they really got into how they ran Zelda for the next twenty-five years, pretty much. A little longer than that. I don't know. I guess a link between worlds, you could argue, was pretty open world again. But yeah, actually. I don't think there's any point in Link Between Worlds that it's just like, I think the only required dungeon you have to complete before another one is, uh, Thieves Town. As far as Low Rubble goes. Also, what kind of name is Low Rubble? Really? <laughs> I can... I can hear the bitterness. Hmm? <laughs> the name Low Rubble. <laughs> I you just have to wonder how they came up with that. They're just like, what do we name? What do we name this place? We called the Oval One Dark World. We want a different name for this one. Well, we've got High Rule, Low Rule. That sounds great. It's the opposite of High. Somebody probably said it as a joke. Pink. And like that's and genius. Nice pink. All right. I don't know how I'm gonna do this without Goodbye, the rules. I'm probably gonna just gonna go until I die and then I'll start over. I believe in you. Okay, a little less after you ran into that dude. These are called Vires, if I remember right. Yeah. Yeah. I I I, I don't ever do this without the. Uh, um, I believe. Blue ring. No, after this dungeon it'll get easier because I'll get a bunch of hearts, but... I don't know, I think I might have actually laughed at Viral. Viral would have been funny. Low Rule just sounds dumb. Oh no, I let the keys out. I wonder what time I could get in Link Between Worlds now. Calm down, Spencer. There's only two. That's not a city. How many? It's like how pink many pinks, villa here. How many pinks does it take? Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> there goes the pinks. <laughs> All that pink. <laughs> the prank. He's doing it on purpose to save time next run. Of course. You are implying that this run will finish. <laughs> I believe in you. I got only my thirty seconds. Time. I got my one gold, so I can. If I die. And then in the future you'll know you can skip blue ring. That will that would be a big jump because I wouldn't need to get a bunch of rupees. Yeah. Like right now I would get this 30 rupee and this 30 rupee. So this might be a gold because Yeah, by it's it's going to be a gold by default. <laughs> by default. <laughs> Although sometimes I already... Sometimes if I have a bomb, I would get this heart piece earlier. Oh shoot, I'm not supposed to do this right now. Just this on the way back. So this is like your own route, right? Nobody drafted this or anything like that? Yeah, I just... I should have... This is in, totally inefficient what I just did. I'm supposed to get this on the way back. How far you've come. Now you're talking about being inefficient. Using save and quits. <laughs> no blue ring. I'm all grown up. 
they grow up so fast. You still get all the heart containers, I take it then? All but one. I guess. Do you the... just do the potion? Yeah. Nice. Well, it can't technically be 100% of you. Decline the heart container. I'm getting this. Alright, I might. This is gonna be a gold. I like how you waited for that rupee even though you're full. Yeah, I know. I, I, <laughs> I thought about that immediately after. It's a gold. Dang, crushed that one. It's because of. See, that's a gold by default because I don't have the. All those rupees that I would have gotten. For the blue ring. To get the arrow were uh, not needed. So that's going to be like an unbeatable gold unless I drop the blue ring altogether. I believe. Maybe this is the beginning of a new... Oh, you get the medicine early. I figured it was going to be like... Gold. On that, I guess that is the last stray one, isn't it? Yeah, I've gotten all the heart... Yeah. Card. Now this next dungeon though, I'm gonna have, there's the, the two rooms with the blue dark nuts. So I could have gone left the screen and got that out of the heart container now. Oh, I see what you're saying. Are you not gonna get the ring at all? No, it's too out of the way. We've gone too far. We're too far gone. How's it going, Julia? Yes! <laughs> nice! Gold's all over the place. Alright, Spencer, we're gonna learn this category. You ready? We're gonna get the gold city. <laughs> Forget the pink city. We're going golds only. We're going to gold town. Wait, what did I just do? I just oh, streamed. Shoot. It was nothing but golds. I'm I didn't have a arrow. single split oh, oh, that no. wasn't gold in that run. Alright, this is disaster. I gotta be cautious. Oh, you don't use bombs for darkness? They're that hard, but I think it's just bombs kill them like super quick. I think it only takes two bombs, maybe even one. I don't know. I mean, I've never learned a whole lot about this game in particular. That was pretty... Yeah, I, I suck at this game. There is no way I'll be ever be speedrunning this. Maybe. What? But Spencer, we were counting on you. I never thought I would speedrun the Adventure of Link, to be fair. So I think, I guess I'm oh, yeah, it looks like it's two bombs. Dang, those are really good bomb placements. By really good, you mean really lucky? It's like, yeah. It's... Maybe it's not two bombs. I don't know. I don't know how this game works. Flip a coin, Luna. All right. Isn't there a way to like manipulate where the recorder takes you? Yes. You just like hold a direction on the D-pad when you use it, right? Something like that. Um, when it picks it's you up. A, I think it's the direction you're facing. Oh, that would make sense too. I use it twice and I know where it takes me. 
Okay, uh, you know what? I don't know if I usually do that save and quit that I just did. Okay, this, this is just rupees. Yeah. I only need the bait, so I'm good with rupees. But... I'm surprised that's a thing I even know about. Why am I using bombs? Thank you for giving me bombs. Oh, thank you, fairy. I needed you. That's a good room for drops right there. Fairy and bombs. I think, I think I'm good with keys the rest of the game. Let's not deal with this room. Oh yeah, you can use keys in literally any dungeon in this one. Jeez, that was a mess. Do you, so you don't get the, do they call it the skeleton key or the magic key? It's called the magic no, key, don't they? It's, it's way out of the way. Yeah, I remembered it being like not in a good spot. I couldn't imagine you would get it. You know what? I'm gonna get this key. Are you gonna get the red mail still then, or are you just gonna skip them both? We're going, we're going balls to the wall here. Oh snap! I remember getting used to link to the past without any of the mail upgrades was was difficult in the beginning. It's an ordeal. Stuff hurts. You mess up in like Turtle Rock, you're getting wrecked. Haku Bakus, whatever they're called. Yeah, Haku Bakus. Haku Those aren't hard though. No. More like the. Green, well, I guess green. nothing. Nice. Back ahead. I guess there's nothing in Turtle Rock that's like that scary, actually. Uh, you get chomped by a chain chomp. You lose like three hearts. I think they do more than that, actually. It is, potentially. I think the spike rollers do four hearts of damage when you don't have mail upgrades. That's uh, crazy. These are the these are my favorite three splits coming up. Get bait, get sword. You have a split there that is what is that? 18 seconds. <laughs> That's quality. Hmm. Maybe I can gold it. I would hate to split that much. My goodness. <laughs> I'm in love with the splits. <laughs> He's a split fiend. You can't stop him. I gotta, He's splitting left and right. I got a split fetish. Okay. Big fan of the statistics. Uh, I don't think any enemy does less than two hearts in the dark world. I gotta change that. I don't. I got, that needs to be a different green. Too hard to tell for you. Like, you can change are... it to like blue or something if you want to to make it yeah. even easier. Where I'm, where I lost time, but I'm still ahead. Yeah. Maybe more. Keep meaning to change mine too, because they are very close. I just always forget. Oh piss! Oh. Blue linos are devastating right now. Oh, I lost 0.2 seconds. <laughs> I imagine the top runs of this game probably don't get the sword upgrades either. Yo, sick damage boost. <laughs> Alright, I gained my 0.2 seconds back. Right, this is gonna be scary. I don't know if I've ever done this without. Oh yeah, this one. Doesn't this dungeon have like a ton of wizards in it? Um. Yeah, this is the wizard dungeon. Yeah. Every dungeon in this game basically introduces a new enemy. That was a bad room. This room right here is one of the hardest rooms in. I remember when I was doing I like how you said that, and on stream I just see you walk straight up through the spike traps. Oh, well you're behind a room. <laughs> yeah, I know. I knew I'm that, but it was just, it was just oh, funny boy. hearing you say this is the hardest room and you're walking up through spike traps. I'm scared. Oh boy. I'm one hit kill. You have a medicine? I can't use that here. 
I think I got a heart, so I think oh, the wizards only that. wizards only take three. I can buy this from my boy, alright. Shoot, shoot. Alright, Spencer. You're gonna race Moss in two weeks in this game. Better learn. <laughs> I don't think I've played the Hyrule Fantasy in <laughs> like six years. Is that a run over? We will restart. Womp womp. We're going again. Oh boy. Uh, I don't know the last time I played this game actually. When I think about it, I probably would have played it sometime this year if my NES still worked. I suppose I can play it on my Switch now. I guess that's true, yeah. I can always play it on my collector's edition disc, but F that. Ooh, I could also play it on my Game Boy Advance. <laughs> we could play it on my Nintendo Entertainment System. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I want to gold this initial, this initial enter level one. Let's see. Oh, there we go. Chasing the gold. I can't tell you how close you are because you don't have your best segment stuff showing up. Oh, nah, forget it. It's lost. Some bad moments. Oh, he, he got stuck on the bush. Runs over. Had a bad corner turn earlier. Wait, did that damage boost? I don't think so. I think you were too close to the edge of the screen. It just pushed you, like, maybe two pixels. Yeah, I saw they added a mode to the Switch one where you can start with just like random items or something like that. Maybe it's not random items, but just items in general. I haven't really played any of my NES library thing for Switch Online. Did you get Switch Online? Yeah, because I would need it to play like Mario Kart and stuff like that with people. They call it Living the Life of Luxury. It's such, a, <laughs> such an exotic name. I with love with it. nine keys and, <laughs> and uh, the power bracelet. <laughs> <laughs> Luxury. Yeah, I, for whatever reason, have a physical copy of every US release of the Zelda series. For no reason. I have Breath of the Wild on Wii U and it's never been opened because I had a Switch. I have Japanese copies of the Oracle's games because I like the art on them better than the US versions. The heck is back on the door. Yeah, I had trick-or-treaters come while I was playing Ocarina of Time earlier. Which is weird, because I'm on the top floor of my apartment complex. It's like all the way up here. And my apartment complex isn't like near anything really, as far as that goes. Gold? Pumpkin no, pie no. is disgusting. I'm disappointed. No gold. Saved 0.3 seconds though. Get a gold. Were there Fortnite costumes? I don't know. I didn't look. There was a lady at my work the other day talking about getting set, making, I don't know, some kind of Fortnite costume for her kid, though. And I was just like, oh, that's gross. What's wrong with Fortnite? No, I'm not a huge fan of pumpkin. I'm not a white girl. I have plenty of friends that like pumpkin, though. Gold, gold, gold. This is definitely a time save. You were really wanting those golds, huh? Dang. You destroyed that dungeon. What changed? I didn't kill any enemies to try to get bombs. Oh. Level 2 is a guarantee. There's, there's a room that has guaranteed bombs. So. so you don't need bombs until level 2 at all then? 
Yeah, well, I mean, it helps to have bombs in level one. Yeah, because but... you said you can skip that key. Yeah. But for consistency, I guess you don't want to try to get the bombs. Anymore. Yeah. For this is Mossy's percent. Mossy's percent. It's evolved from being called ZD percent to Mossy's percent. Well, for this one, yeah. <laughs> this is probably going to be a gold as well. I'm not bothering killing those lionels anymore. Or the levers. Yeah, I think learning like which enemies you can ignore and stuff like that generally helps improve splits a lot. Like what you can ignore. Right, so I'm gonna lose. I always lose time on this dungeon. But let's see if I can. I think I've already learned which enemies like don't need to kill these guys. Don't need to kill these red gorillas. Saying so, is what I mean. Like you're saving time just because you're not killing things that you don't need to kill. These guys. Shoutouts to gorillas, by the way. Was this the last game they had boomerangs? Now they have boomerangs. No, they do an adventure blank. Was, were they in games after Link to the Past? They're in Oracle of Ages and Seasons. Are they in Oracles? Oh, I'll tell you for it, I don't remember much about Oracles again. Those are games where it's like, I can remember it as I'm playing it, but I just, I can't remember really outside of that. Link's Awakening. Yeah, Link's Awakening is one I haven't really played in a long time. I keep kind of wanting to, but finding time for it is hard. I always try to tell myself, like, oh, I'll learn it, because then I could go stream it here. And then I just, I never get around to it. Yeah, zero to eight bombs in one room, nice. So does the sword do damage to him while he's blowing up or something? There's a way you can kill him faster. Huh. Okay, that's not that bad. I didn't lose that um, much time at the time. Three and a half seconds. What are you talking about? Stores around here already have Christmas stuff up. Christmas season now. It was Christmas season a month ago, apparently. <laughs> there was a channel on TV today that was playing Christmas movies. Really? Christmas movies on Halloween? Yeah. I forgot the uh, Joseph was flipping through trying That's to find stuff. crazy. We debated for a while whether we felt that if Friday the 13th was a Halloween movie. I don't remember it enough to give a ruling here. I don't watch much movies anymore. Do they always drop bombs if you do it that way, Joshua? Lionel again. <laughs> this is a split you can blame on RNG. He was just in the wrong spot every time. I think if I have full power, I can just power through. Doesn't he do like three hearts? I'm not sure, actually. I don't know how much a Lionel does either. I feel like it's three. I think contact does less than uh, the sword. Than the sword? Might be a gold. It's not. Still a little save time though. 
So the default settings, if you can see the countdown start, well, I guess you might not have because of the delay, but if you can see the countdown start, that's from your board split. Right. Yeah. I'm watching on uh, a stream. That's yeah, like, that's what I said. You're probably on, like watching on the delay, right? Yeah. Okay, I got that. Oh, go on hazardous noob. What a name. <laughs> it's fantastic. Right, we are gonna get the white sword. Or the blue ring. Oh, he's immediately backtracking on his balls to the wall strats. That was backup belt, balls to the wall. <laughs> backup balls. Backup balls to the wall sounds a little more painful, personally. <laughs> I don't know how that makes sense logistically. <laughs> That's why it sounds a little more painful. I feel like something's getting crushed. circle. I like the joke in Legend of Neo when he gets the white mail. Like, yeah, because in your green one, you blended in with the woods. <laughs> no one could see you. Come on. Get some gold. Should be gold. Nice. I love gold. This is uh, a golden green. This run. I should definitely. There's like new keys I'm getting in this dungeon that I used to not get. I think they're much better to get these keys than some of the later keys. So this split, I'm gonna lose. I've been getting this key. I feel that this key appears. A good key to get. Oh, do the merchant clothes change colors because of the color palette? That'd be interesting. Never noticed that. If that's the case. I believe that is the case, yeah. yeah this that's what Aid Link is saying. Because I know, I think I've explained this to you before, like that's just how some of the enemies straight up work in A Link to the Past. With the, 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 um, yeah, they just use the dungeon color palette. So it's like gray and the gold ball and chain troopers, for example, oh are the same exact enemy. One's only gray because the tiles in the basement of Hyrule Castle are gray, and the other one's gold because the, oh. <laughs> the other one's gold because tiles in the Hyrule Castle tower are gold. Jesus. Gonna keep going with it though, huh? If I can finish this dungeon, plus 30. I will. Oh, these guys respawn? Why? Death cost a lot. That's redeemable. I believe. Jeez, go away. Got him.
Nice spike jump. Dodge. Words. Have you ever gotten him with one bomb? Yeah. Nice. Ooh, another gold. We're gonna gold the split here. All <laughs> 17 seconds? No, we're not. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. That was good. That was... That was <laughs> <laughs> it's a 17 second split I'm gonna lose 5 seconds <laughs> uh, I guess it would be like a 40 oh yeah this is your 40 second split what a what a mess you only lost, you only lost 4 and a half seconds for that no big deal it would have been gold <laughs> The fact that you can use keys from any dungeon in any dungeon makes routing this category in particular really interesting. That was not a good room. I did really good at this get ladder mm -hmm. last time. It's gonna be hard to gold that. Yeah, sometimes you just end up with splits that you feel are not possible to beat. That was good though. Okay, never mind. I don't know what I'm <laughs> talking about apparently. That was not a good uh, get ladder though. Oh man, you sounded like a speedrunner. But because the keys got away and I had to go back. I don't, know what... I don't know what to tell you. I think um. There's there's only a, there's a very few splits that I've done very very well. Like I think I can still gold almost everything other than maybe the the, the five second split the the the, the twenty second split. <laughs> Those might have reached their capacity. There. Well, we should look at what your sum of best is after this. I'm it's curious. not. I thought about adding that to this, but it's not appropriate for this particular run because I have the uh, some of the splits are dependent on what I have. Oh, because you like have to reroute on the fly sometimes. Yeah, right, that's on. kind of the only reason why I haven't really thought of putting that in here. I think buying a key would lose time overall, Joshua, because it would cost you like a hundred rupees. I think they're a hundred. Nice Gleop fight. Might be a gold here. Nope, just a pink. Just a pink! Pink! <laughs> so I golded this get arrow. There's no chance whatsoever of golding it this time. Not at all. No way. Because I had 255 rupees. Oh, yeah. He just went straight there, pretty much. Uh, I assume Spencer either got caught up with whoever was at the door or just passed out. My rupee count is behind. Oh, no, no, no. I just gotta get the 100.
not going to get that heart piece now. I'll get on the way up. I feel like it would take me a good number of playthroughs to remember where all these little secrets are. Most people, I don't think, if you look at speedruns of this, nobody gets any of the rupees. Yeah, no one like upgrades the mail or the swords, I imagine, in speedruns, because it takes too long. I don't yeah, think I'm... any of them are like conveniently along the way to getting to somewhere. I want to say people still get the white sword. Not the best Isn't players, kind of but... out of the way? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, not, anyway. not the best players, but like... After the top 10% of the scores. Beating this yeah, game I with, can see it. without the white sword and without the blue tunic is... That's... Uh, that's hard, I think. Yeah. There are people that... You know what? I'm still gonna gain time here. For, for the past. But I know there are people that still do like gold sword and silver arrows. For any percent, even though it's slower, so it's easier. Yeah, I'm still gonna gain time here. Not gold, but. Well, wait. That's no, not far from not being gold, gold, actually. That's about. Seven seconds off, it looks like. Okay, maybe that's not. What the hell yeah, did I do last time? Then. I don't know, you kept stopping for rupees you didn't need. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. Oh, maybe you just had better movement overall. I golded this enter level 5 last time, but there's no way I can gold it again, because I'm going to get the heart container. Wow, that's probably part of it, because you got the heart container in the last split, remember? Right, I did. I, but I, one heart container does not equal three secret weekly locations. Uh, he did miss an L in typing glitches, didn't he? Let me see if it Really? <laughs> yeah, it says glitches. Glitches! This is a glitches run. Video glitches. Hopefully it'll fix itself. So. Yeah, there it goes. Still in the positive. I think. I like how you went from. 51 seconds ahead to 26 seconds behind to 20 seconds ahead. It's very consistent. There's a lot of consistency with this run. <laughs> and don't count yourself out. I PB'd with a run like that. Pretty stupid. That's one thing good about not having a fantastic time. You can mess up a lot and still improve. There's this one guy that runs Legend of Zelda that I watch. His name is JSR. And, uh, like, he'll mess up. He's really good. And he'll mess, up, like, he'll mess up one thing early on and he'll lose five seconds. And that's a reset. Is he like world record contender or something? He has 29 minutes. Oh, that's not bad. on this category though. In any percent, I assume. I think any percent world record is like 27 or 28. So I think he does the no no up and a. No up a, yeah. That's generally what people run for this game. All right, that was some good. 28, 26 is the world record. So I guess if you're chasing, that was PB, as good as that, that might ever get. Um, 
Maybe. I remember when a couple years ago people thought sub 30 wasn't possible. Oh, shit. I'm so. Damn it. Nice. That's I was cool. supposed to save and quit there, but I didn't. Oh, oops. The only thing bad about saving quit is you dropped the three heart containers. Oh, does it reset your health? Yes. I guess that would make it a little more complicated. That would get good. Look, I should have definitely saved and quit there, though. That, that was a mistake. Mistakes were made. Yeah, I still got golds. Can't give up the category yet. Wow, there are a lot of people that have ran this game. 211 missions for any percent Legend of Zelda. Any percent, no up A, at least. Only 21 for regular old any percent. Wow, there are so many categories for this game. This category doesn't even make the main list. You gotta go to, like, the, the kids category. <laughs> to be fair, I think Minish Cap might be the only, like, top-down game that has a glitchless category. Well, I guess Link Between Worlds, if you're counting that. I think Link Between Worlds does. But for a lot of Zelda games, playing it glitchless is not considered as fun to watch, or play for that matter. Yo, sick right. damage boost. I was allowed to play a little careless there because I had that, that extra health. And I skipped one Gibdo room. Where I would normally get that key. So I don't think I, I gained time, but not gold. No, it's not a gold. Still gained 21 seconds though. Glitches just take practice to learn, like, what he's doing now. If he was just practicing glitches instead, it wouldn't really be any different. Ugh, darn it. There goes the gold. <laughs> what the are the whistle? Oh. Better reset. Use the ladder in the wrong spot. <laughs> hit by like six P hats there. Is it still gold? Nope. Nope. All right, come on. Let's let's gold this. <laughs> he really wants that gold. I think this gold is more about when I hit the button than my actual gameplay. Near flawless uh, split so far. Look at that movement. Oh no! Oh. Oh my god! Oh god, I bumped <laughs> up the staircase! <laughs> Lionel, like, oh boy. Uh, Some serious Lionelage. That would have definitely been gold. Yeah, probably. You're only off by four seconds. Ugh! <laughs> I, can't, I can't do it! He's cracking under the pressure. I can't believe you had that as a split. That was 18 seconds <laughs> long. <laughs> Look at that. Those are my favorite splits in this run. Ooh. Ridiculous. <laughs> yeah. That's a compass. I gotta stop killing those enemies. Uh, 
Hey, you, you're yes. <laughs> as long as the run makes it to 28 minutes, he's happy. He gets to those splits. I would not speed run if it wasn't for the uh, for for splits. Need the splits. changing items. Yeah, and it's unfortunate because, like, the menuing in this game is very slow. I don't feel too confident about my health right now. Actually, nah, I disagree, Taylor. You don't need that many splits. I need some more splits. Hey, I've I've hit a 710 split once in my life. <laughs> Still don't know how. This is looking go oh, no, this is not going right. I don't think I've been bowling in like a year now that I think about it. Probably longer. It's not a thing I do a lot. I'll go with a group of friends, maybe once a year. set up the splits for a Twilight Princess. I think there was like 120 splits. What? How? <laughs> How do you have 120 splits? They're not even like that uh, close. What? What are you splitting at? <laughs> goats. Goats 2. Goats... <laughs> There's like... Oh, you split for every goat you run into the bar. See, this is starting to make sense now. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> split, 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 split. <laughs> How many did I get in that one for? <laughs> uh, restart. I messed up my splits. <laughs> this is a bad room. Ooh. Gimme, gimme, gimme. <laughs> goats too win. I like that you chase that fairy for a heart and a half to you. I need to shoot my sword with power. <laughs> That's an old all bag. This is a tough one to do. I played this and I ran out of keys the other day. Ran out of keys? Yeah, I, I messed up my key. I don't have the keys memorized how many I need for the later rooms. Later. I think that alone would help save you a decent amount of time, honestly. What's up? What's going? How many keys you need for like the later dungeons? I think would save quite a bit of time. Yeah. I think I entered this dungeon with five, and I leave with two, or it might be four and two, or it might be three and two. I I definitely lose keys in this dungeon. Oh boy! Look at this guy. Oh my god. Oh man. I I don't think I've ever gotten three strikes in a row. I've gotten close a lot, but I don't think I've ever hit the third one. This is the 
new strategies in this room. I've heard a lot of things about Red Dead 2. I just don't really want to play a new game right now. Yeah, I've never gotten a turkey. I'm generally good about not throwing gutters anymore, but... I'm still a good time save, though. So this is when you go one screen down, you face the right, and you use the oh, whistle. so it's based on the screen you use it on, too? Uh, it takes you to level two, and then you're... I think it, it goes, like, basically in that direction that you're facing. Actually, oh, I don't know, that doesn't make sense. it goes until you hit a dungeon in that direction? But I think the thing always comes from the left, doesn't it? No, the direction you're facing. Yeah. It doesn't make sense. I, it, it, I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna, I'll, I'm gonna say I'll look into this one day, but I probably won't. Not bad. Oh, look at that. Nice gold. 0.4 seconds. Waiting for the run where you blow up the wall and kill Manhandler. Plain ball. Nice. Mm -hmm. Oh, crap. That's going to respawn all of them, isn't it? No. Oh, okay. That's good. That wasn't that bad, actually. Bomb drop would be nice. I believe a turkey is three strikes in a row. I believe this room drops bombs. I wonder if these guys work the same way that uh, Helmet Sires and Link to the Past do. This is a room. Not a very uh, impressive room right there. It's okay. They can't all be impressive. I've tried to do the ball spin with bowling before, and it just ruins my wrists, so I don't care. It's bowling. I don't have a bomb. I need a bomb. Uh-oh. For the entrance to the next dungeon. Good luck. Gotta murder some Octorox. Yeah, I just do the straight bowling thing. I've heard bowling described as it is a sport that no matter what you do, you can never look good. Because if you're bad at bowling, obviously you don't look good at bowling. But if you're good at bowling, you just look like a dick. Nice time save. So this one, you just don't change anything. You don't even move. You just do the whistle, and I think it takes you to level one. Huh. I'm kind of curious about how this works now. Alright, thank you. <laughs> that blue Octorok gave me the the one at the beginning of the game. <laughs> <laughs> you were just saving it for later. Because I have to kill that blue Octorok, I'm not going to get a gold. <sighs> almost got hit there. Ooh, that line almost got you. Oh, that one did get me. Oh, and yeah, that one did get you. Oh, jeez. Imagine if that was my Someone bomb. The name Spectacle Rock. 
Last time I played this, I was gonna beat this dungeon my time by like a minute and a half, but I ran out of bombs. It's unfortunate. But I found there's a safe strategy. One of the Patras that I usually just skip holds a bomb. In fact, I think that's an old man quote. <laughs> Petra has the bomb, I think is a quote. Skip has a bomb. What'd you say? Said one of the patches that you skip has a bomb. That's the old man quote. Yeah. <laughs> but I remember thinking like, man, where do I get bombs? I was looking like at the, the map that I have. And I'm like, oh, there's bombs in this room. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, yeah, I just got to kill the Petra. And, you know, I think it, it might. Oh, Petra has the map. Never mind. Yeah, you're right. Wrong old man. <laughs> this tenth bomb is the secret. Oh man, this is a bad Petra fight. Oh my goodness. Has this enemy ever been in another game? He's I guess there was this one similar in one of the Oracles seasons. It would be, I guess, since seasons really wanted to be this game. Yeah. That's the only other one, isn't it? That's Oracle of Ages, actually. Was it really? Yeah, I guess Seasons just rips the like actual dungeon bosses, huh? The boss of uh, Moonlit Grotto. Huh. Dang! What a long animation. the boss of Moonlight Grotto. Moonlight Grotto. Boss of the fourth dungeon, Skull Dungeon. Yeah, I wouldn't remember. I remember Gnarlder Dungeon is like the first one in Seasons, and that's about all I remember. And what, uh, Sword and Shield Maze is the last one in Seasons? Yeah. About all the only dungeon names I remember. Skull, you use the switch hook to kill it. Yeah, he uses switch hook to trade places with it and then go to town. So yeah, I guess it would have to be ages, because that's not in seasons. Yeah, seasons... I'm pretty sure most of the, if not all of the bosses in seasons are the same exact bosses from this game. Not all of them. What ones are different? I guess... Mothula. That's true. And then, uh... Medusa. Medusa, yeah. I think Medusa is actually unique to Seasons. I don't think that boss has been in another game. Well, we're not counting... Onyx. Yeah, I don't think Medusa hasn't been in another game. General Orlux. <laughs> Bombs, enough health, enough keys. I think we got this. As long as I don't have a miserable Ganon battle again. Maybe I should use it. I believe in you. I think uh, if I get hit by a wizard, I die here, so why not just safety? There goes 25 seconds. This is so long. <laughs> this 
is uh, not a very impressive Ganon's Death Mountain, whatever it's called, it's dungeon. This means there's more time saves next time. It's all about setting the bar low so you can achieve. That's how I live my life. It's a horrible way to look at it. I believe that was ages, Joshua. I get those two games mixed up a lot, though, so... Tend to spawn in that corner more often or something? Or are you just uh, kind of stabbing? I, I don't really know. I, I gotta learn this better. <laughs> Fair enough. Yo, PB! Nice. Sub 46. That means we're uh, still playing. Oh dang, that puts you up into 18th. Did I pass somebody? Oh wait, that puts you into 17th. You passed two people. Woohoo! Nice. Bastards. Who did I pass? Uh, Mad Bomber XX and Gary and Old Wolf. Mad Bomber XX. Suck it! Suck wow. it! Getting called out. Yeah, I'm gonna tag him on Twitter. Oh God! <laughs> I should, I'm gonna, you know, everybody I pass, I'm gonna see if they have a Twitter, and I'm gonna tag them. Is it to start to start up some rivalries here? Get people to come Jeez. back and play. That, that was probably. A... I don't know that enough people would care about this category to bother. <laughs> There's like 20 scores, or some close to 20, right? Uh, 21. All right. <laughs> I told myself I was gonna do at least two runs, but I think we probably yeah, wanted a half is good enough. I think it was more like one and three quarters because I did a half a run, a quarter of a run. <laughs> so I'm gonna keep going until I get no golds. And I don't get a personal best. If any of those happen, then I'm going to retire. He's going to go into retirement. Retire on top. <laughs> retire on 16th place. <laughs> <laughs> then, nah. Nah, I'm going to move on to another game. I told myself I'm going to play when I stream, though. I'm going to do multiple runs each time. To sort of get myself in a rhythm to start playing a little longer. Oh, so you're gonna try to pick like another shorter game next then? Well, there's nothing in this even remotely close to this short. Uh, yeah, I guess as far as like glitches or minimal glitches, it glitchless minimal glitches. Link to the past might be the next closest. I won't play Link to the Past. That's like the one game that's no way I won't play it. I just, I just don't want to. You hate the game that much, huh? No, I don't want to. I don't want to <laughs> like ruin the relationship I have with that game. I oh, play I it like that. once a year, sometimes twice a year, and that's it. And I, I don't want to. That's not going to change with that one. I can't, you know. I, I, yeah, I this, can respect that. This game, I'm kind of competing against myself in a sense. But I like, I'm not gonna run this at the marathon or anything against anybody. So it's like that's what? okay. You're not gonna have the ten way glitchless TDO LOZ showdown elimination. 
<laughs> First, uh, last person to enter dungeon one. Oh man, he got eliminated because he killed the blue hawk drunk. We need we need twenty eight people in elimination after every after every split on my oh, list. God, <laughs> imagine that forty second split to not get eliminated. That race. Ten hours of setup time for a <laughs> for a less than hour long race. <laughs>